Scott May winding up the greatest career in the history of an Indiana basketball player. Back when IU won one of the basketball championships, it was a really big deal. It would obviously be a really big deal today, but back then it was huge. Bobby Nice wife. They're going to wind up with 32 wins in a row. Down to Wayne Rathbone. One second. The basket is good. The campus went crazy for a little bit. I know that some of the fish were actually taken out of the fountain by students. They were so excited, they were so happy that IU had done so well in this tournament and then won it, that they went to the fountain, grabbed the fish, somehow removed them from the fountain, and took them, just scattered across campus. I'm Kyle Jean Jenkins, and I'm a student here at IU. There was a story told to us um, during orientation. So in 1987, we won our last NCAA National Men's Basketball Championship. We so obviously the tour groups and the um, orientation groups, they really helped as far as just filling in tons of random facts and fun facts about IU myths, legends. Talking about, so they never found the fifth fish, which is why that first fish right in the front is a little bit smaller than the other ones. It didn't get the dimensions right, but it kind of symbolizes that loss of the one fish. Where do you think I used to think it was on top of Ballantyne, but I was lucky enough to go up there once, and the only thing up there is vertigo, really. Like, you know, a fear of heights. Uh, so, my new guess? I'm gonna say somehow, somewhere behind the bar of Nick's.